Many people are wondering what the difference is between the covering that Muslim women wear and a nun's habit. Well, let's see. A nun's habit is the uniform for a particular religious order. It is a free choice and a rather lengthy process to go through to become an, a nun. Uh, this process could take one, two, or three years before a woman takes the final vows of chastity, poverty, and obedience, which are the usual vows. Um, the, the nun's habit also indicates that the body is good and is set apart for God, and that the woman is now the bride of Christ. It is also normally associated with service to the poor. There are many different types of nuns' habits that have been throughout the ages. And what a lot of people don't realize is that many religious orders were started in the Middle Ages and that the wimple was worn by many women at that time. And so the nun's habit just reflects contemporary attire, the, the, the contemporary attire of that time. Although new orders have new dif and different kinds of habits, like Mother Teresa created, when she started her own order, uh, used the sari because she was working in India. So there are different, uh, many different types of nun's habits. Nuns were the first to run hospitals, orphanages, and, and schools. So many of our basic social structures that we have today were started through the work of religious orders. And even nurses up until very recently wore um, the nurse's cap that is a vestige of the nun's habit. Now, let's look at the covering under Sharia, under Islam. Yes, also it is associated with modesty. However, it is not an option under Sharia law. Um, the basic concept here is that the body is bad, especially a woman's body is considered a source of evil and must be covered. Um, that men cannot control themselves at the sight of a woman's body and that social chaos will ensue if women are not covered. So here we see that uh, with this quote from the Quran, that the, head, the covering is most convenient that they may be distinguished and not be harassed. So what often happens is that when women are not covered in Islamic societies, that it's, it is seen as an invitation to be harassed and even raped. So, is the covering worn by Muslim women the same as a nun's habit? You decide.